Hey everybody, Flick here for another Let's Look At video, except this time it's a bit of a special one, because it's a game, not yet released in any form, called CLR, which stands for Cannons, Lasers, Rockets, which sounds like the three best ways to solve a problem. It's an indie game, and it's another one trying to get on Steam Greenlight, so it's keeping with the theme of the other two Let's Look At videos I've done so far. It's in very early development, and it's a mixture of 2D and 3D shooting in space. So I'm here on the starting ship, and please keep in mind everything you're about to see is very early build, and there's more information about the game at their Greenlight page or their website, which will both be linked below. Uh, there's a myriad of ships available in this build, I think it's half a dozen actually. Each with a main weapon and then three unique special abilities. So the one we started on fires rockets, um, it can charge enemies, it can turn into a flying fortress for collision damage getting decreased, presumably so then you can smash into things. Yeah, you can even ignore collision damage, so that's what that's for. And then there's he's more stealth based. Um, I've been using this ship, so unfortunately his abilities have been used up, but he's a kind of middle of the road person. He seems like a stats effect causing ship. Another kind of middle of the road. Uh, no, anti stealth, actually. And that's a very funky looking ship. So the game is primarily deathmatch, although there is cope in the sense of you can team up with people to form one of the sides, and I think it's 10 versus 10 in total that they're aiming for. So what we will do here is, uh, rather than jumping jump into an empty game and deal with the static AI enemies pottered around the battlefield to give you XP to use in the shops and whatnot, there'll be a fade out here and then a fade into hopefully a game between myself and some of the other people getting this early look at the game, playing some of the devs and no doubt getting our RCs handed to us. So stay tuned for that.